What is up everybody? Today I'm gonna to be walking you guys through the entire liquor collection in the Johnny Drink Studio. Okay, so these are a lot of the sponsors we've worked with in the past or are still working with. Um, as you can see, a lot of rums over here, some gins. This is Gunpowder Gin, one of our favorite gins. Um, super good looking bottle, great taste. Highly recommend you guys check that one out. These are actually um, barrel agers, so you can age whiskeys and bourbons in here. We have like a bourbon right now, as you can see, Johnny Drinks, Smoke the Glass. These are promo kits. A lot of companies will send these to us and I love seeing these. I mean, people are so creative. This is a tequila, uh, another tequila 818, that's Kendall Jenner's, got some mezcals over here. Some of our bourbons, this was the Johnny Drinks exclusive blended bourbon. This is no longer available because it's sold out. Uh, Howlerhead, just worked with uh, Dana White's Howlerhead whiskey, really good banana flavored bourbon. So Clearwater, actually super interesting company. They don't really do straight whiskeys. They normally do like a blend. So this is a blend of rye and Armagnac. Come over here, this is where the magic happens, right? This is where the first ever Johnny Drinks video was filmed. The setup is actually pretty similar to what it once was. We hung this bad boy up. I got it for him for Father's Day. Um, some accessories. This is actually Three Spirits non-alcoholic elixirs. It's filled with like some holistic ingredients and stuff like that. So this is really cool for people that aren't trying to drink. This is the liquor drawer. As you can see, we have our vodkas. Uh, this is a mini fridge. We have a lot of brands send us either seltzers or beers. And so really, really cool branding um, and something like this or the Topo Chico's. Another mini fridge for the keg that is currently not there. This is normally the liqueur drawer. So things like a liquor 43, we have Aperol. These are the sweet liqueurs. Espresso machine, I got this from my dad for Christmas. I am very proud of this bad boy. I use it every morning. An espresso machine. Thank you, Liquor 43, for sending us that. And here is the infamous fridge. Um, no, this is not our only fridge. We don't just drink liquor. So since starting this whole online brand, we quickly hired a pretty experienced videographer. And to keep up with him, I started using Skillshare just to learn a little more about Adobe. And for me, it was really good just to better understand what my videographer crew was talking about. Skillshare was simple, it was easy to use, it was engaging. Um, highly recommend you guys checking it out. And I'm not the only one benefiting from Skillshare. Our sound guy, Jake, just learned how to play the piano. If you know nothing about piano, I'm pretty good at piano. Skillshare is an online learning community with thousands of classes for people to learn something that they're passionate about. Make 2022 great and learn something new. The first 1,000 people to use this link will get one free trial month of Skillshare. So click that link ASAP. All right guys, to finish off this tour, we're gonna let the big man go through all of his special bottles of liquor. This is actually a special one. No name, no brand, no label, but a special guy gave that to me. In here, a lot of recognizable bottles. You know that one, you maybe know that one. They're cool, but one of the coolest ones is this right here. The reason this is cool is because it was guys being dudes. The night we had in the basement, my nephews, my sons, and we commemorated by signing that bottle. Over here, one of my favorite sections. These are the uh, dead soldiers, if you would, right? So I had begun my wine collection many years back, and it was really simple, reasonable bottles. Each one of these, we drank, we had fun, we had moments once again commemorating a good time. Open it, finish it, and I save them. This is pretty cool, Scotch Whiskey Club, right? This is a 30-year-old Scotch. So we had that, that's nicely commemorated in this beautiful box. These are really special. My father gave these to me. These are from Germany. These are German Steins, beer Steins. This is a pretty cool bottle. A friend of mine, Chinese friend, gave this to me. It is a Maltai Asian Chinese wine. I guess it's like a sake. Um, 106 proof. You gotta be very careful with this guy. This is a bottle of Lemoncello. Went to Italy in 2012. My family went to Sorrento, Italy. Anybody who's been to Sorrento knows there's lemons all over the place. Hence the reason they make very good Lemoncello. Now we have some collections of some nice things here. Um, very good friend of mine, Dave, gave me this uh, nice bottle of tequila. I haven't opened it yet. I'm gonna save that for a nice night. Have some people over. You have your uh, traditional tequilas here. You should recognize some of these bottles, right? They're all here. And up here is yet again, another one of those moments that we commemorated. That was in 2014. A uh, few very dear friends, work friends, had a nice night out. We signed the bottle. I got the keepsake it, so that's special for me. So this may look recognizable, Tesla. 
right? Tequila. Got that from a good friend of mine. He uh, hooked me up with that. These guys are special. Um, if they were full, they would be even better, but we drank them, we celebrated some good nights at Del Fresco's. Um, this is a 23 year old, or was a 23 year old Poppy Van Winkle Reserve. That was a fun night. That is it guys for the tour. Let us know in the comment section what your favorite bottle was. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe and like for more of this content. Cheers Thank guys. Thank you guys. Thanks.